one is the actual remote, which is now all the buttons are moved upward on the remote, so you just have to use one finger instead of a few, along with the other side, which is the same QWERTY keyboard, but the buttons are a bit bigger, so that's easier to use for people who have big fingers. Um, so there's that. The best feature that is, I would say, the most featured feature in the new generation is the voice, uh, the voice button here, which is basically the voice search. So you can literally say whether you're looking for a movie or a TV show or a website. So let's just say I was searching for a movie. I would go ahead and ask it. Looks like it uses the Google search function. So instead of having to scroll through things or try to find it, it pops up right away. Great. Yeah. And then I would and then it gives you other related options. You can rent it from the Google Play Store? Correct? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, and also let's say it's on TV, it would show me that option as oh, well. Neat. So Great. right here I'm gonna just press rent. And then it gives you all the options available okay. where you can rent oh, okay. it. Okay, great. Exactly. And then the microphone is on the yes, remote right there. itself. Okay. That little dot. Really cool. So now let's, I'm just going to give another example. Let's sure. say I don't remember the name of the movie. What I could do is say, movie about a robbery in a casino in Las Vegas. So essentially it utilizes the Google search, voice search. Exactly. Great television. Exactly. Oh, you know with all this noise, it's really recognizing. I know, voice. look, it comes out. Oh, there it is. Ocean, Ocean 13. 13. Perfect. Right, so then I would click on that. I'm like, oh, that looks like the movie I was thinking of, and then it'll give you even more related yeah, options. Yeah, okay. Perfect. So that's really helpful. Yeah. How many times do you forget about what a movie is called yeah. or an actor? Exactly, you know? yeah. So that's easy, and then I would say, you know, also if there's something else that you wanted to search for, like for example, I like to bake, so yeah, okay. if I wanted to say, figure out how to bake something, I could say, how to make an easy chocolate cake. Normally you don't have to cover it, but with yeah, all the of course, noise, yeah. <laughs> so there it goes. And then it's going to show me all the different options and play a video. So on. it'll come up with YouTube videos and such as search results? Exactly. Okay. So it literally goes through everything. Um, so I'm going to go back to home. Now, there's a couple other features. I'm using the manual remote, but you could also use the gesture button, okay. which and then it becomes a oh, magic neat. remote. That's awesome. Yeah. So I'm going to click on, this app is called the Primetime app, and it shows, my favorite one, it shows all the live movies and TV shows right now that are on. So you can scroll through those, and it shows the time too, so you can see exactly how much is left. And then up here are all the movies and shows you can choose from. Again, you can just, if I had one of mine, I could ask and do the voice command, or I could just search for it manually. Yeah. Um, let's see, and then another great little button on the remote is the guide button. Okay. Which is way easier, let's just say you came home and you wanted to just find something on TV, which everyone does. Yeah. You can just press guide, and it pops up. All the different shows that are on right now. Okay. And all the different genres. That's comedy, this is drama, sports, news and talk. So all those are on right now. So that's and it gives you pictures as well. So that makes it a lot easier yeah, to find. No doubt. Um let's say also I wanted to go online and I didn't want to have to go you know, you can go to Google Chrome, but yeah. instead of having to go through that, you can just say Facebook.com. So, yeah. it hears the .com, so it knows it's a website, yeah. so it goes online, goes to Facebook. Great. Yeah. 